to another My Name Toys video. Today, ladies and gentlemen, we are back yet again with another toy hunt. You want to know why we're back with another toy hunt? We're back with another toy hunt because I still have not received my Elite 92. Everybody else has, has their Elite 92. I'm talking all the, every every YouTuber that, that is even affiliated with the WWE action figure scene. You have every Instagram account that I ever followed has their figures. Everybody that pre-ordered them on pre-order one has their figures, man. I'm the, uh, I guess I'm the only person that has not received their order just yet. I think there were some shipping delays or something in my area. I, I don't even know. I even looked up the tracking for my AEW Unrivaled 8. The pre-shipment label was made on the 18th and it has not moved from that location five days ago. So I don't I don't know what's going on. Hopefully Elite 92 and AEW Unrivaled Series 8 will be here tomorrow. At least, at least the Elite 92. Just give me the Elite 92 tomorrow and then I can start getting reviews out by the following day. So we still won't even have reviews tomorrow. I hope to God that somebody cares about the reviews by then. I don't know, you guys may wait for my review anyways, which I just truly and genuinely appreciate, but that is why there's been a delay in the Elite 92s, man, because I just, I don't have them. They haven't arrived at my door yet, so I do apologize for that. But since we do not have our Elite 92, today we're going to go back to my local Target and see if we can find anything else. I went there the other day. They were absolutely stacked to the rim. I'm, I'm hoping to find maybe the Jake the Snake Chase Legends figure. I would really like to see that figure. I haven't even opened my other Jake the Snake. I did get, I ended up the other day I ended up getting a couple Triple H's and a few other things but I did not know if I wanted to do a two-in-one of Triple H and Jake the Snake because if I do a two-in-one tomorrow of Jake the Snake and Triple H the next three days are going to be reviews too and then you have AEW Unrivaled Series 8 coming in and it's literally going to be like 10 straight videos of reviews and I don't care I, I don't know do you guys care about that are you are you on board with that I mean it's just I get hit with when we get hit with a lot of products I mean that's just the way it is sometimes but hopefully you guys will appreciate it anyways and enjoy the reviews because I sure as hell enjoy the reviews. The reviews are very enjoyable for me. I like to take a look at the product and explain to it how good they are to you guys or how crap they are, and then giving you my damn thoughts on those. So we have lots of videos like that coming soon to the channel. Maybe reviews are your favorite. I don't know. But anyways, guys, we're going to get into it. I'm going to hit you guys with the clip of me at the store, and I will come back here and see if we ended up picking up anything or not. So I'll see you guys on the aisle. All right, guys, here at Target. Still pretty loaded up. I mean, we're, we're still pretty loaded up right here. We got top picks Jeff Hardy in the house. We got Goldberg over here. I don't see Roman Reigns, though, which is kind of weird. I don't see any Roman Reigns. We do have Ultimate Edition Kane. We got one of those. We got Bob Orton, Triple H again. Jake the Snake, though. Trying to find that Chase Jake the Snake. That's kind of a weird thing to say. Chase Jake the Snake. Trying to find that, but I'm not seeing it. We do have a lot of Bobs here. No Hurricanes I don't see, so I don't really know, man. You know, just trying to, trying to find all the good stuff. But at the end of the day, you know, we're, we're, we're just looking for that Chase Jake the Snake. You know, tongue-tied, but not much else going on. You got the battle packs. You got the ATV Wrecking that we reviewed yesterday. Go check that out. JoJo. Look at Dada. What do you have? What do you have? T-Rex. T-Rex. An alien. Good job. Good job. You want to get, get down? down? <laughs> What's he eating? What's... Eat the floor. Eat the floor? Okay. Ew, that's a nasty floor. That's right. So... <laughs> Here, what? Look, what else do we got? Look. What's this? What is that? Lion. Lion? What's, what's this one? Which one? Which, this one? That's a T-Rex again. Which one? You want this one? Bullseye. Bullseye? He, he, the horse. The horse. This isn't bullseye, the That's horse. Not bull this is That's, just a regular horse. Look, I think bullseye's over here. Oh. Uh -oh. Just gonna throw it. No. I don't think they have a bullseye, Jojo. Look, Jojo, no, come look. Not. Jojo, look. Who is, who is all this? Oh, he's look, he's some bouncer. Oh Lord, Jojo. Big green monster truck. Find big green monster truck. You sure did. You found a big green monster truck. Look who's over here, though. Come here. Jojo, look. Who's that? Who is all that? 
Buzz Woody. And who's that? Buzz. Who's that one? Jess. Jesse. Who's that one? Wes. Good job. Who's this one? Shady Dog. Who's that one? Who's Forky. in the corner? Forky. Good job. You already have one just like I that. I think you have Super this exact Super thing Super almost. School bus. It's in a school bus, <laughs> kind of, yeah, RV. Look, who, look, look. Monster trucks are loud. Monster trucks are loud. <laughs> that is a big, big monster truck, huh? Well, that's about it. Excuse me. Maybe you can ask for one of these for your birthday. You like the purple? Your birthday's coming up, Jojo. Why don't you ask for this for your birthday? You like the purple over the green? You like both, okay. All right, guys, we're back home after the toy hunt, and I must say right now that they have pretty much the same things they did the other day, right? It's pretty much uh, on a whim. It's exactly what they had, except they had some more Ultimate Edition canes. I left those this time. I did not grab all those. I think they had, was it one or two? I can't remember, but they had Top Picks Hardy, Top Picks Goldberg. I didn't see a Top Picks Roman Reigns. I haven't yet to see a Top Pick Roman Reigns. I don't know if they're just not on the shelves or if they have them in the back or what the case is there, but it is, uh, you know, that that's probably the hottest figure in the set. I would say it's probably the best figure in the set. I love the Jeff Hardy to death, but I think the Roman Reigns is superior. You know, the gold gauntlet, you got the cool shirt, you got the, you know, the nice head sculpt on there, double jointed arms, back tattoo. I mean, that Roman Reigns is a beast. It really is. So I could totally see that being on board there. It is an excellent figure and I have no issues with that whatsoever. So them being gone, I don't think they were ever out though. That's the thing. I don't think they ever put them out on the pegs, which is very weird. Maybe it's because the, the pegs are stacked. When I first went there the other day, the Goldbergs were like down a little bit. So it's like they put them in like the, you know, that weird section of like Star Wars plus like the Disney kind of figures right there. That's where they were for some reason. I don't know why that was the case, but that's where they were. So I don't know about all of that stuff, but I did not grab anything. I didn't see anything worth grabbing. I did, you know, I, I let everybody else get in on it. You know, you got Top Picks Hardy, Top Picks Goldberg. You got the Legend Series there. You got the full Legend Series there. Yet, had, oh wait, maybe Hurricane was missing. I can't remember, but we had Triple H there. Plenty of Triple H's. We had Jake the Snake. We had Bob Orton. We had China still there. That, those Chinas will be there forever. We still have AEW and Rival Series 6 hanging out right there. You had Sheeta and Jake Hager and Ray Phoenix. I don't know if I'll ever grab uh, any of those. I just don't see the need to grab those. I think if AEW 7 hit, I know that particular Target store did get AEW and Rival Series 7, but I didn't pull the trigger when they were there. I didn't find any chases. Of course I didn't find any chases. Well, what are we doing here? So those are just some of those things. But the other day, I guess I could show off what I grabbed the other day, right? Because they're right here. So keep in mind, this is not this trip that we just went on. This is the other day, so they've already restocked here. But we did grab a Jake the Snake the other day, like I mentioned in the beginning of the video. Did have the chase. We checked for the chase today. They didn't have it, so there is Jake the Snake. We also grabbed a Triple H, because I want one to have in the Army gear. And then I had to have another one so that we could rock the under the under gear, the gear that I've been waiting for them to make in Elite Form forever. So they finally made it. They made it in a battle pack before, I think with Road Dog or Billy Gunn. I want to say it was Road Dog, and now we have an Elite form. I had to have it up on the big Triple H shelf over there. It's one of those gears I really wanted. And then the last Elite that we grabbed, since I did a fix-up on my Top Picks Hardy, I went ahead and grabbed another Top Picks Hardy just because I wanted one that had the yellow and blue face paint that looked like this. And this is his last figure from Mattel, maybe ever. I mean, we may never get another Jeff Hardy Elite, so I wanted to go ahead and grab this. Uh, this will add to the 60 Hardys or so that we have up there, and I'll probably get end up getting more. But, you know, this is still really cool to have, and I wanted to add a Hardy. So we have, I don't know why I said it's so weird, Hardy. So we have the two Triple H's, the Jake the Snake, and the Jeff Hardy. And yeah, I mean, that's that's pretty much it, man. That's what I grabbed the other day again, not today, because I didn't see the point in it. The other day, we also got, remember when we went on that one toy hunt, we found a cane and the hurricane, so I went ahead and grabbed those canes and hurricanes. Canes and hurricanes. 
Legends. I just noticed that too, but we've been buying a lot of ish from Target, man. On top of this, we also got the uh, the ATV or the four-wheeler from uh, the Wreck and Slam little deal there, and we grabbed this, and we did a review on it yesterday, so if you guys missed that review, definitely go check it out, but yeah, Stone Cold Steve Austin on the ATV there, which looks really badass, by the way. I really like the way that looked, but it was, a, it, I mean, it's been a crazy month at Target. We've been hitting and hitting and hitting, which we love to see, but I think that is pretty much going to wrap up the Toy Hunt video. I hope you guys did enjoy. Let me know what you would have grabbed down below. If you guys want to see the Triple H and Jake the Snake review tomorrow, please let me know down in the comment section. If you guys want to see, you know, the rest of those Elite 92. The Elite 92 reviews are coming. Let me know which ones you want to see first. I'm guessing Burnt Fiend and Adam Cole would come first, right? I feel like that would probably make the most sense. Elite 92 is kind of a weak set, like, when you look at it from the full, full gear. I guess we'll have to get into that when we get into the My Damn Thoughts and break down all the reviews. And then we have AEW Unrivaled Series number 8 coming. So, tons of reviews, tons of new things coming to the channel. Hope you guys do enjoy. Let me know all your thoughts down below in the comments section. But follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok at My Damn Toys. I've been posting a lot of fix-ups and stuff over there. But thank you for watching. Subscribe to the channel. I'll see you guys in the next video. Don't cross the line like me when I keep buying all these figures from Target. You cross the